Hello, hello, hello. It is almost summer and I have my eyes on all the fun things I'm going to do. Let's draw a self-portrait. I have two sheets of paper, scissors, a glue stick, and I'm using markers and crayons. To start, I have my first paper horizontally. I'm going to fold it in half. And then on the fold, I'm going to draw half of my glasses. So I'm going to draw it all the way across, make a big curved line, and then that part right where the fold is, is where the bridge of my glasses are. That's right where the nose is. So I'm going to cut it out. And as long as I made sure that the bridge of my nose, that little skinny section in the middle, is along the fold, when I open this up, I will have both of my lenses for my glasses. Ta-da! Now, I'm going to draw the inside edge of my lens so that it separates the frame from the lens. And instead of in the lens just drawing a reflection, I'm gonna start thinking about all the things I'm going to do this summer. I know I'm going to the beach, so I'm gonna draw a beach scene in one lens. Maybe you're going to an amusement park and you like roller coasters. Maybe you're going to go skating with your friends around town. Maybe you're going to have a picnic at the park or go on a slide. Or, you know, eat watermelon and lots of fresh fruit. Hang out with family. You get to pick the things you want to do this summer and draw those in the lens of your glasses. When you are ready, you can begin to color. So I'm going to start with the frames of my glasses and then I will color in everything I've drawn inside my lens. Everybody's glasses should look different because we all have different summer plans. Have fun! I made sure that every part of my glasses are colored. When yours look like mine, you can move on to the next step. Now my second piece of paper is portrait style. I'm going to flip it over and find the edges. So see how I'm gluing where the edge of that back paper is? This is because if I were to glue the entire outline of my lens, I would end up getting glue not on the paper and it would be on the corner and stick to my table. Make sure you press it down so that there's no creases near the top of your page. When yours looks like this, you're ready to draw your face around your glasses. You can pick any hairstyle you like. 
I have long curly hair, so that's what I'm drawing. You could do ponytails, you could do pigtails. If you have shorter hair, you can draw yours like mine and then stop below the glasses. Now you can pick a nose and a facial expression. I wanna make mine look really happy because I am so ready for summer. Almost there. All that's left is the neck. I'm gonna draw a curved line at the bottom to show my neck is round. Curving lines for my shoulders, and then if you want to show your long hair, you would draw that below the glasses. From here, I'm just gonna add a couple of details to my hair. You could add details to your shirt or in your background if you'd like. And then, when you're ready, start coloring. I'm using a combination of markers and crayons. And because I have so much color going on in my glasses, I'm actually going to keep everything around them pretty simple. I'm gonna draw my hair in brown. I'm gonna add my skin color next, you'll see. And eventually, I will have a complete self-portrait where the only thing I have to do next is add in my background. And because I made my face so big and I really filled my space, it was a really quick marker. All right, I can't wait to see how you color and finish your eyes on summer self-portrait.